So hello guys and welcome to this video and today's new videos on a brand new project that is really really exciting. So this is Hero Fire. So before getting this video, make sure to hit the subscribe button, leave a like, and yeah, it does mean the absolute world. So let's get straight into this video. So this is Hero Fire and this is a play to earn game. I'm so looking forward to the release of this. The release of this game is the 20th of November, so definitely guys, not too long. But you can buy their tokens and view the marketplace. Let's read through what Hero Fire is. So, Hero Fire has two game modes. So you have PvE and PvP. For PvE, you just need to complete the basic daily tasks easily to get the reward in the game. In particular, for PvP players, will be able to participate in the arena and receive rewards when they've reached the top. However, the special thing that only Hero Fire's PvP mechanism has is that no matter what rank you reach, you can receive a reward, instead of just receiving a reward when ranking at a certain rank. The reward is more or less depending on how much you rank, but the higher you rank, the bigger the reward you get and the higher rates of interest. So. Even if you invest a certain amount of your capital to own powerful heroes, just rank high, you can pay back after only one session. Players can completely get multiple heroes for free by creating different accounts. However, accompanying the free to play mechanism is the play to earn mechanism, which means that players need to play the game to receive the reward to ensure fairness. For hero fight, just playing or receive a reward, the more you play, the more you win, the more, the higher the reward. So it's looking really, really good. A play to earn, we know how big play to earns get. Like we see Axie Infinity has been going through the roof and has been going for ages. Now I can really see this project following the same footsteps, especially with the graphics. The graphics are really, really cool. So let's have a little look. There's currently a whitelist registration going on to get early access to the gameplay. As we can see here, this is the registration for Hero 5 Game Beta, 10,000 players. So there's probably quite a lot of people who've already applied, but you can definitely have a chance to go on it. It is on the Binance blockchain. So yeah, I'm definitely going to be signing up and buying a few people already so 20th of november is the release date so the new era of the nft game so complete free to earn hero fire is a mobile arpg game in which players can earn tokens through pvp pve battles between heroes each hero is unique and equally accessible to anyone there is no initial investment barrier in hero fire Quick one guys, you can actually play this game on Android, iOS, PC and Mac OS once the whitelist does come out, once the whole game basically comes out. You can play on your phone which is really really cool. So well cast collectibles with sophisticated graphics, no inflation with burn mechanism of the ROFI token and 55,000 plus members in the global community. So here's what the gameplay looks like, and it does look really, really cool. I can really see this taking off because it does look very, very interactive, and the graphics are very cool. If you see how fast it looks, it just looks very, very clean and slick, which I can see being a huge hit. So here we have the campaign mode, a PvP mode, and a tower mode. So there's three different modes, which are really really cool so here we see the marketplace so you can have a look at all the different creatures all the different characters which i think look really really cool like you can just collect them it reminds me very much so of uh, world of warcraft let's have a little look at the marketplace so the marketplace as we see here you can get a genesis pack so an egg will give birth to a genesis hero whose reproduction time is not affected by their level so you can basically buy a hundred thousand of these tokens and you'll get one egg here are the characters guys, so we can see all the different types of characters right here, each one is different in the slightest way, all of them are level 1 at the moment because the game has obviously not started, but once the game does come out we'll be able to see who and who will be the best ones basically, so I actually might get involved and buy one of these because I do like the idea of them and just having my very own hero fi looks really really cool just to show off and I love the interactability of this. So if we just have a look at how popular it has been, so the last 24 hours, it's already been at $20,000 already sold, so 41, last 7 days, $180,000, and the last 30 days, almost $1 million of trade volume has been reached. So it's going crazy, it's going parabolic, a lot of people are jumping on this, but it's still very, very early, guys, and this is where you can make a lot of money. So the tokenomics, so there's $520 million to supply hero eggs tokens to hatch eggs and there's 288,000 roughly a day. 
So here we see play to earn, trade NFT items, buy NFT tickets and upgrade heroes. So here we see the members as well. So this is really, really good to see the members because it shows transparency and there's a name by every single one. So it shows that it is legit and they're not afraid to show who they are. It means transparency and it's not a scam, which is really, really good to see. They have advisors as well. So the roadmap. So let's go straight to Q4. Offspring function release on the website. So that's done. Open beta game. Roffy official listing on exchanges, sell and buy items on the marketplace, game version version 1.1, build Hero Fire's multiverse gameplay, Q1 2022, Hero Fire official release on the iOS, so that'll be released then, and governance release. So about the multiverse. Hero Fire Multiverse is a massive universe that is embraced of different game worlds within Q4 of 2021. There occurs the merging of Hero Fire into the metaverse world of GameFi. So here we see the partners as well, so it's loads and loads of different partners. If you have a little search through, we can see Infinity Capital, Gem Hunter Ventures, and we also see ApeSwap as well as all these different ones. Also being advertised on Yahoo Finance and BSC News as well as at Market Watch. This is really, really big to see. So if we head over to the Hero Eggs, we see how many people are holding them at the moment. So there's actually quite a lot of people holding them, but it's still very, very early. You can check out their link tree as well. There's loads and loads of different things you can join. We can see their Telegram has over 61,000 members, which is absolutely crazy, guys. Definitely head over and join it. And their Twitter with over 81.2 thousand followers. This is absolutely crazy. They're very, very active as well. So I am very, very excited for this. So if we have a look over here, so the daily quests. So... As we see here, so a one star hero rate of each reward pool following the types of heroes is 4%. So the total amount of reward pool following types of heroes equals the rate of each reward pool following the types of heroes. So there'd be 4,608 and the more, the higher basically the star of the hero, the more you get basically. So the daily quest, so the number of one star heroes participating in the PvE per day is 10,000 heroes. The number of two star heroes participating in the PvE per day is 1,000 heroes and three star is 1,200 heroes. So this is the figures right here to the total pool and the total reward one star is 4%. Two, for two star, 6% and three star, 12%. So basically the best one to get is three star. And also here's how the arena PvP is broken down. So the one star 4%, 6%, 12%, 18%, 25%, and 35%. And this is the total amount of reward pool for it all. So this is showing you the passive income, what's going through here. And here's the basic league. So the medal for godlike, so rank one is 4% reward, arena points of 500, gets 500 arena points and rank top one. This is the ranking condition. Then rank two to 10 is legend, reward 18%, and then 400. And there you go. And rank 11 to 100, diamond, 45% reward. It's going up and up and up until it reaches platinum, which is 23%. And then gold is 10%. So this is how it is broken down into for your passive income. So this is why the play to earn is very much essential. And then the Premier League, so for four star to six star heroes, these are really, really rare ones. This is how it works out. So Godlike, Legend, Diamond, Platinum and Gold. This is how it's broken down into. But yeah, it does look very, very good. And the rate of investment will be really, really good as well. So I am very, very bullish for this project. It is looking very, very good. And also that we have the multiverse. So the Roughly allocation in multiverse. So in one day, the amount of roughly disputes across the multi-universe is only... Across the multiverse is only 288,000. The more games integrated in the multiverse, the more opportunities for players to earn Roffy. Roffy is distributed based on the number of players in each universe, which increases Roffy search demand and uses Roffy in every universe. Roffy reward allocation total generated in one day will be divided among the games in the Hero Fire multiverse. Players will both earn from Multifi and earn from other games which integrated in the Hero Fire multiverse. There's also NFT space travel essences. So NFT space travel essence is the only spare ticket, is the only space ticket that transports hero to other worlds. NFT LG space travel essence is used to travel through the space portal. However, essence is assembled with separate pieces and depending on the number of stars of the hero, the number of pieces to create a complete essence is different. So two star hero requires one essence, three star hero requires two essence. So a six star hero requires five essence. So the public sale of NFT essence. So in this round of essence public sale, you'll buy essence points. So that's you can combine them into essence for the heroes you currently own. Snapshot 
times will take place at 8 a.m. on November the 9th and the official public sale will take place a day later on November the 10th. So definitely guys, this is definitely a good idea to get into. So this is Hero Fire and I'm very, very bullish. I'm definitely going to start buying my very own eggs as well as a few heroes already because it's going to go absolutely crazy. And make sure you head over to the whitelist competition and try get in releasing on the 20th of november so that's when the play to earn gets released so guys i hope you enjoyed the video this is herofy make sure you head over in the description and head over to their website and links so guys i hope you enjoyed see ya bye